going on YouTube in this video right here I'm going to show you guys how to make gray zone warfare more optimized smoother gunfights and higher FPS and stabilization I've been struggling with gray zone warfare smoothness especially during gunfights inside towns FPS dropping to 30 40 uh, still playable in my opinion still enjoying it but I, I was just you know that, that was one of my complaints and today on X formerly known as Twitter, the official Gray Zone Warfare Twitter account posted a thread for troubleshooting and optimizing the game, whether it's general, general performance issues, crashes. I'm going to put that thread link in the description below, so make sure to go check it out if I don't cover what you're looking for or troubles that you're having. This video right here is going to cover how to increase FPS and smoothness in Gray Zone Warfare from this thread. It worked for me. It was tremendous. So I just had to share it with you guys and hopefully get to somebody that they can make their gameplay more enjoyable so they can have a better gaming experience. So here is how you increase FPS and smoothness in Gray Zone Warfare. You're going to open up your Steam account. You're going to go to Gray Zone Warfare on your left side. You're going to go to Properties. Once you go to properties, you're going to go to installed files and then you're going to browse wherever your game is installed at. Once you go there, you go to GZW binaries, Windows 64, and you're going to see the application right there. You're going to right click it, go to properties, go to compatibility and make sure you click disable full screen optimization. Make sure that's enabled. Apply. OK, boom. Now I'm going to take you to the end game settings. Okay, for my end game settings, you go to graphics. Make sure your game is on full screen. Make sure your FOV is at 55. I was playing at max 75, but they recommended to uh, do it at 55 FOV. Make sure your frame rate limit is at 120 FPS. I kept my background right now 60. Default's 30. You play with this, see how you like it. But frame rate, frame rate limit, do it at 120. And your quality presets, I keep mine at low. I also seen if I drop, if I raise it to higher or epic or medium that my CPU started running really hot. Uh, so I kept it at low and you will see in a minute or two the gameplay of how day and night it is. Honestly, it's just absolutely incredible. This, this fix here. Also, before we go into the gameplay, let me show you exactly uh, one last step you need to do. Also make sure to go to your NVIDIA control panel and make sure instant replay is turned off. Disable in-game overlay in your NVIDIA GeForce experience panel. Those steps right there kind of helped me. Now here's the gameplay of the difference. And yes, I died making this YouTube video and sharing this with you guys. So if you guys would like, I would appreciate if you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it with your friends, someone that can help enjoy this game a lot better. Because I know this is going to make my gaming experience so much better. I appreciate it. I love y'all. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.